Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. So as you may guess by the title, we have bought Pablo a new bed. Now I didn't know we were buying a new bed. Chelsea just decided we were going to buy one while we are getting his food. But before we go into the whole bed situation, because a lot of you may know that a structured bed has been something we've been wanting a while, but never got because somebody destroys him. I'm sure this is probably going to be in the title, but Pablo has been sick recently. So, new bed. Then he was sick. He wasn't sick in the new bed, do not worry. He was sick on his other two beds through there. He was sick on the living room carpet. He was sick upstairs on our bed and sick on the floor and sick on Mickey. Is that all you were sick on? Were you sick on anything else? So we reckon when we went to Keswick because he was eating loads of duck poo, it was probably something to do with that. And just had a bit of an upset stomach. He's been fine today, my grandma took him. Said he's been absolutely fine, played about with Miley. We were gonna set the GoPro up and test Pablo with the new bed because normally he's destructive when we're out. When we're here, he's fine. Anyways, story time. So it was about one o'clock last night when Chelsea decided to shout at me saying the dog is being sick. Here's our bed here, been washed. This one has been washed. This one has also been washed. Come on, you, let's go upstairs. You're gonna have to excuse the mess because everything got thrown around last time. So the duvet was on here and he was sick on here and then it dripped down onto the floor down here. So I gave Chelsea a blanket, she went back to sleep. Now, bearing in mind this was like one o'clock in the morning this happened. I was cleaning them, putting them in the washing machine, but obviously the duvet doesn't fit in the washing machine, so I hand washed that in the bath. This is where things get interesting. So now I'm going to start cleaning the duvet. I've sorted everything else out, cleaned the floor, everything like that. As you can see in our bathroom now, the duvet is in the bath. It is on the ironing board, so it can drip dry. It's a little damp still. That's all. Actually, it's kind of dry. So I need to properly dry it. Need to properly dry it? Yeah, need to properly dry it. This is all your fault, mister. So yeah, Chelsea had a bath earlier on, had some like bath bomby stuff in the bottom of the bath, so I thought I'll give it a rinse out with the shower head, and there, because I didn't want any of that on the duvet, so I switched the shower on, and this happened. So I switched the shower on, and this happened. So I switched the shower on, and this happened. So it's fixed itself. Perfect, this is exactly what I wanted. Anyways, this thing here blew clean off the wall. I ended up getting soaked. There was water absolutely everywhere. So then I ended up cleaning the bathroom for ages, drying everything, getting everything out of the way. That's why this is on the floor here, because that all got soaked. So you're just making an absolute mess. So tell the people, when daddy went to bed, bearing in mind he starts, well, he gets up for work at about seven o'clock. You know I'm gonna tell them? It's about half four. Yep. How far we went to bed? You don't look too guilty. You don't look guilty at all, actually. You're a good lad. Are you feeling better now? Are you feeling better? But yeah, Pablo absolutely loves to snuggle up against stuff. So, the reason we didn't get a structured bed, and if a lot of you guys who remember us from the very early days when Pablo was a puppy, I'll throw some clips in here, maybe. He used to absolutely destroy them, which is why we could only trust him with the flat mats. So we've decided to try, seeing as he's a bit older, he's a bit more mature, try and put him back into a structured bed. So far, he's loved it, but like I said, he's only been in here one day, and then he was sick everywhere, so we haven't trusted him with it today. He obviously got taken, taken away today. So me and Chelsea are at work tomorrow, but we won't be leaving him for that long, so nobody's come around to get him. So what we'll do is we'll set up the GoPro, see how he acts with this bed by himself. See if it destroys it or we'll actually leave it because I'm sure he'll absolutely love it. So we'll catch up with you tomorrow after we've filmed the GoPro stuff and we'll review that and see what he got up to. Yeah.
Okay guys, so before we start, anyone goes into the comments and starts ranting about anything, saying we can't look after our pug, anything like that. Chelsea did leave the door shut. I brought it up with her. So yes, he didn't have access to the kitchen. Would you stop? And as well, this wasn't actually recorded the day I said it was going to be. It was about three days later because Pablo does not get left at home that often for us to be able to film him doing stuff like this. So luckily I was back soon enough, so he was absolutely fine. He's... Don't worry about him, look at him. Hello darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk... Previous video we did got a real spike all of a sudden and I got a lot of messages saying we could not look after Pablo because we filmed a video of what he'd done at home and people were like, should leave him at home. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, we made a mistake here. We hold our hands up to that. We're not perfect, just like everyone else. And Pablo does not get left at home all the time. Like, he doesn't. Normally, we struggle because we come home and you're not here. You're just gone. You just don't come back, to you? You prefer to be away. Stretching. Ah! So, yeah, the bed. He didn't actually do anything with it really he started chewing the label off it now i'm pretty sure i mentioned the label was still on it inconveniently he started chewing it so yeah other than that i mean like i said it was three or four days since i said we we're going to record that and it's been absolutely fine except when i came back today why pablo because of this so that's what i came home to so He's had that bed for a little while now, and obviously, yeah, he's destroyed it today for some reason. But, I'm well, not sure, he does enjoy it, he does like sleeping in it, but we've always just got this thing that, once he's ripped the middle out, you then can't sleep on it. So, you're in it for yourself. <laughs> well, I don't think you fully understand that, do you? Nope. So yeah, we'll wrap this video here. I'm sure you'll get an update in the future whether he's destroyed it or whether it's fine. But yeah, if you liked the video, Drop a like as always, drop any comments you have down below. And if you're new to the channel and want to see more of this face, then do hit that subscribe button. And as always, people, peace out.